So the Affordable Care Act, or Obamacare, promised us better care at lower cost. It failed. There are things we can do now. What we need to do is put power back in the hands of individuals to take control over their own health care. What do individuals need? Well, they certainly need choice. They also need transparency, and they need flexibility. But it's not just about the individual. Our providers need help, too. They need to be incentivized to innovate and keep costs low. If we do those things, then Americans will finally get the affordable health care that they deserve. Remember what the president said. He wanted to have greater affordability, greater access. What you're seeing in New Hampshire is neither. You're actually seeing, uh, I just talked to a gentleman yesterday who owns a small business out in Portsmouth. He's paying $2,000 a month for he and his wife for uh, health insurance, $24,000 a year with a high, pr a high deductible. It is not working for his family. It's not working for most families. And those families who are on the Affordable Care Act, uh, they're seeing this year 40% increases right here in New Hampshire. On average, it's costing a family of four $1,200 a month. It's just not uh, sustainable. You need to have a far more free market approach. You need to bring more carriers back into the state, not less. You need to have transparency in the cost of, med of medicine. We don't have that currently. You need to be able to purchase across state lines so you bring that uh, opportunity of, of greater, uh, greater competition here and then you will start to see the, the cost be driven down. And finally, we need to be proactive about uh, our, our health, not reactive.